Hey guys, I'm Ina Lazarov here with Mike Berkovici after the most convincing win against a Pac-12 team all season. You guys controlled from the get-go. How does it feel to get a win like that under your belt here at Sun Devil Stadium in front of your fans against such a highly regarded team like Stanford? Yeah, it feels great. I mean, I know in uh, December it didn't feel good walking off that field without heading to that Rose Bowl, but basically we knew we knew what we were up against. We knew the identity of Stanford, and uh, we just had to focus on ourselves, so it was exciting to, to come out with a win. Was there a sense of redemption? Oh, absolutely. I mean, we've been talking about it since, since we lost to them last year, so we, we, the, the model that we use is kind of taking the crown back to, from such a quality opponent, so they're, they're a Pac-12 championship caliber team, and, and now we are too. You were able to move the ball very well against the top defense in the nation. How would you rate the performance of the offense overall tonight? I mean, uh, Stanford is a great defense. Watch them on film. We got an opportunity to take that bye week, get extra film study in. But uh, that front five, they did a great job. I kind of rushed a couple of throws I wish I had back. But like I said, they did such an amazing job kind of taking hits off me all game, getting that run game going. And like I said, we're, you know, we're, we're lethal when we can run the ball and, and give it, get those uh, big plays down the field. The defense had arguably its best performance all season tonight. When you see those guys playing the way that they were tonight, is it an even bigger motivator for you and the rest of the offense to go out there and put some points on the board for them? Oh, yeah, absolutely. I mean, when you play against a big team like Stanford, especially on the defensive side of the ball, um, you, you got to come to play. And, you know, Jordan Simone, uh, Demarius Randall, those guys, uh, Lloyd Carrington, those guys on defense did, did a heck of a job kind of creating an identity for the rest of the season that, you know, it doesn't matter how big they are, you know, not, you're not going to push us around. You are at the halfway point of the season. What is ASU's identity? We're, we're, we're smart, we're disciplined, we're tough, and we have character. And that, that's what's going to propel us to this championship race. It seemed like all week you and your teammates were very confident heading into tonight. Do you credit the preparation? Absolutely. I mean, we're, we're you know, 98% preparation here. I mean, we, the way we practice is unlike any other team in the nation. And, you know, Coach Graham does a great job of cre creating adversity for us in all situations and preparing, preparing for us for us, uh, you know, on Saturday night. So, you know, our special teams defense did a great job keeping us out of an adverse situation. So it's an exciting team win. Without revealing too many secrets, why is it different practicing at Arizona State than it is anywhere else in the nation, like you say? Uh, C uh, CTG, Coach Todd Graham, that, that, that's, a, that's a game That's all we get? Yeah, that, that's a game changer. What is it about Todd Graham? His energy, his, his passion. I mean, when he, when he stares at you in the, in the eyes and says, you know, don't turn the football over, when you, when you come out on Saturday night and he says the same thing, it's like, you know, I, I've been here before. You know, spring ball, it was fourth, you know, third and goal. You know, he, he's, I've, it's like memories kind of flash back to practicing. So it's, it's exciting to play on Saturday, Saturday night in front of the fans. It sounds like a respect thing. Absolutely, absolutely. What is the atmosphere in the locker room right now? And what did Co Coach Graham tell you and the rest of the guys after that win? It's simple. I mean, we 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 base ourselves off character, and uh, you know, going out tonight, we you know you don't need to be anywhere we're not supposed to be because this that's going to take us to where we want to where we want to go. Ultimately, our goals are are to be Rose Bowl championships champions national champions so any anything that uh, other teams do in the nation we're not going to do because we, we're different we're, we're one, the one of 124. Do you expect to start next week at Washington? I'm, I'm a role player like I said if they, if they call call my number I'm in but I, I hope to see Taylor back on the field you know I love him I know it's hard for him to sit I couldn't imagine being a senior um, you know being out right now but I know that kid's doing everything he can to get prepared. What do you, as a team, need to do to get prepared to go and travel to Seattle and get that W against Washington next week? It's never easy winning on the road, but we got to prepare. You know, we got a six-day week. We're used to these bye weeks, so um, just watch our film. You know, focus on ourselves. Come out, come out tomorrow. Watch film. Run. Tuesday practice is is for a championship. Congratulations, Mike. Thanks. For DevilsDigest.com, I'm Ina Lazarov. Keep it posted to DevilsDigest.com for all of your latest ASU football coverage.